Hi guys, this is Jeff at Slavens Racing. This video is about batteries. It's battery season. You know, you guys are breaking your bikes out of the garage about this time of year, getting a little uh, spring fever, and you're going to hit your electric starter and find out that maybe you need a new battery. So if you do, we highly recommend lithium batteries. They're much better than the old lead acid batteries. You know, they're lighter weight. I mean, they're less than half as much in weight. Most of these batteries only weigh a couple of pounds. And we stock four different types, just to give people a selection. There's more of them out there, but uh, we're not gonna handle every one. So I've got them lined up here from left to right, from most expensive to least expensive, EarthX being the most expensive. So EarthX is made right here in Colorado. And it's a great group of people up there. They do a great job. They really support their product. They know their product extremely well. They make them for motorcycles and airplanes and uh, uh, probably some other applications. I'm not sure. But uh, this battery has a two year pro, uh, non prorated warranty. So anytime it fails within two years after the date of purchase, they'll replace it for free. That's uh, different than most of the other ones. I think all the rest of them have a prorated warranty, but I could be wrong on that. You'll have to check their sites to get the exact details if that's really that important to you. So this is a very compact battery, as you can tell by looking at it here. And it's a very, very well built. All of them are here. We don't really, we specialize in quality products at Slavens Racing. I do not need the headache of dealing with cheap junk. Uh, I'll leave that up to our, our some of the other guys out there uh, on the internet. But uh, there's not a lot to tell about this battery other than it's just a good quality battery. It works very well. We've, we've had uh, hardly any warranty wish issues with them. But that's really the case with all of them that we have here. You know, if I have a product where I have a bunch of warranty issues, I just dump it, move on. I don't have time for that. That uh, I don't like the grief that causes our customers. It causes us a lot of grief because we got to deal with, you know, retrieving it, shipping it back, uh, dealing with a warranty claim, all that type of stuff. I don't need that headache. So we typically stay away from any products that have issues. And if we find out that one does have an issue, you will not sit on our site much longer. Anyhow, the EarthX, made in Colorado, good quality product, uh, non-prorated two-year warranty. So Shirai, these were one of the, this was one of the first companies to market with lithium motorcycle batteries. And we jumped on board early on. I don't know when that was. I'm going to say six, seven years ago. And it's a great product. I've used it as well as the firepower on the end. I've had great luck with both of them. And this little port right here, you know, it's, uh, excuse me, I'm just doing this one-handed here. There's a port there for hooking up their proprietary battery charger, which you do not have to use that, but that if you're going to buy a battery charger for this battery, then I'd recommend buying theirs because it you know really balances the cells and has a management system in it that doesn't overcook the battery. Uh, the best feature about this battery, it's a five-year warranty. Uh, I believe that's prorated. You can check their site to make sure, but it is a five-year warranty. That's the longest one out of any of them. And let's see here, the anti-gravity, uh, I believe it's a three-year warranty. And the cool thing about it is this restart feature. You can see this restart technology. So what that means is that when the battery gets down to a certain level of charge, it goes into a sleep mode so that you can't uh, drain it all the way. So if you're in a, some bad situation trying to get your bike started and you get down to that point where you've think you've killed the battery, you can go right up here to this little button and press it, and there's some charge left in there. They've, they've left enough charge in there to, to start your bike. Obviously, you want to make sure it's going to start at that point, that you fix whatever reason was causing it not to start. So that's an excellent feature. Also, they have four battery posts. So these have been the post. So there's two positive, two negative, and what that does is it allows you to uh, have different options for mounting it in your bike. So maybe if you even had it in, 
and one bike, because these batteries fit a lot of different models. You have it in one bike, and then you switch it to another bike, and that battery, the terminals are in a little bit different location. Well, this would uh, make it easier to accommodate that. Another little feature they have here are these plastic plates. So uh, there's a box, there's two of them come with it. And you can see on the bottom here, there's holes. And this just goes into there, and then there's another one over here to do the same. Anyhow, you get the point. Uh, so that way you can raise it up or down in your battery box, depending on the bike you're putting it in. So it just allows you to adjust it for the for the bike. Uh, most of the other batteries come with like uh, these uh, dense foam uh, pads so that you can fit it correctly in your bike. And the last one, and it's definitely not the least, it's uh, Firepower. And this is a product through Western Power Sports that we get. And um, it is the cheapest one here. You can look up the prices on our site because, you know, there's a lot of different pricing here depending on what bike you're putting it in. But this is the cheapest one, and Alec and I are both kind of cheapskates. Alec the general manager of the store here. And so he put one in his 450, I think it was over three years ago. It's still working great. And I've got one of my, couple, two of my 300s, and that works great. It's got a shorter um, warranty. It's a two-year warranty, and I'm not sure if that's prorated or not. Uh, but anyhow, it does have a nice little feature up here where you can kind of test it. So maybe you're thinking about a ride this weekend, and you're wondering if your battery is charged. Just use this little button right here. You can see it lights all the way up. This one's full. So I kind of like that feature. And speaking of charging these batteries, if you're going to charge them, then you need to have a lithium battery charger. But I've got a lot of fancy equipment in my man cave at home, and I don't have a lithium battery charger. And why is that? Because I never charge any of these. Uh, they, they hold their charge extremely long, like way, way, way longer than a lead acid battery. And if you just ride your bike every once in a blue moon, you're going to keep it charged. So I don't really feel like it's necessary to buy a charger unless you're going to let your bike sit for a year or more. And if you're doing that, well, maybe you should uh, rethink that and ride your bike more. But all these are great products. They all have different functions and features. Not functions, but different features, excuse me. And I don't think you can go wrong with any of them honest with you. If I did, I wouldn't be selling them. Uh, they're all great products. Like I said, this is I'm a kind of a tight water when it comes to batteries, and so that's what I'm running. And this is by far our biggest selling battery. And I don't know that we've ever had any warranty claim on it. I don't think we have. I could check with Alec to make sure, but I've never heard of a warranty claim on, it, on this. You know, when these Shirai's first came out, if you bought one, say, six years ago or something, and you might have had problems. And we had quite a few problems with them in the beginning. And I kind of hung in there because it was the only game in town at the time. Well, there was a couple of the little small guys doing it, but um, but now we don't. We just don't hardly ever get warranty issues. And if we do, it's usually some uh, installation issue where a guy hooked up the terminals backwards and fried the battery or something like that. But. Uh, and when we send those in, you know, the companies know what happened. They can tell. They take them apart and they look. So, you know, don't try to pull, pull that one on us because it's probably not going to fly. But they're all solid products. Check them out at slavensracing.com. Please like us on Facebook. And uh, I think that's about all for now. Appreciate your business, guys. Hope you have a good riding season. Take care.